You guys would have seen that we are doing up our camper at the moment and today is a shopping day to try and find some things to spruce it up and start my visions on my camper. So obviously shops and stock is not really something that goes hand in hand at the moment in Australia anyway. So we're going to go to Kmart and we're going to try our luck and see if I can find the things that I want. But again, it's so unknown what we're actually going to find. <laughs> so I'm going to go for like a farmhouse kind of style. So it's all the um, black and white check, um, like played, however you say that, stuff. Um, with just really subtle tones and greys and whites and all that kind of stuff. So And wood. So I'm really excited. Make sure you subscribe to my channel and follow us along on our camper journey. So I've packed the essentials for today's trip with the toddler, which means snacks and more snacks. <laughs> on guard sanitizing mist, so for all the trolleys and touching things that are in public. Um, I hate germs, I always have. This is pre-pandemic. Um, but yeah, on guard is my jam. Money, ta-da. Okay, so we have just pulled up. We're ready to go in. And I just wanted to put a disclaimer that I have no idea what kind of footage you're going to get. This is my first time filming in public like this. And yeah, obviously filming in public for the first time is quite confronting. So we'll see how we go and I'll try and make this video as good as I can. So bear with me and yeah, let's go to Kmart. Kmart! Kmart! Yay! Give me your hands. Let me hold your apple and you can rub your hands together. Boy. Windy. This is the problem we're having. And I kind of felt like we knew that already. But I was able to get some boxes, my turntable for the fridge, and a step stool so Isaiah can start his toilet training. See how we go. Your new trick show me a new trick good one <laughs> okay so we had a little bit too much fun at Kmart <laughs> and we're going back in because we forgot something Are we done? Yeah. We're going home? 
We got some money. Cool. Okay, so we did it. We went to Kmart. We filled the trolley. Um, and then we had to come and drop it off. And then we forgot something. So we had to go all the way back in. But we did it, didn't we, buddy? Yeah. He's exhausted. Um, I still have to go and pick up my Coles order and put it in the back of the car and go home. Um, I did a little food shop in Audi. I didn't bother filming it because it was literally just bananas and a little present for my friend's baby. And because it's baby week, baby special buys. <laughs> um, but yeah, in Kmart, it was really hard to find stock. There was very bare shelves still. So like the blanket tops that I really wanted, they weren't in stock, which are my main camper piece. Um, a pendant light that was not in stock. What else? Pretty much everything for the camper was out of stock, but we got a few things, so I will do a haul when I get home, so stay tuned. And then when we finish shopping, we spray our hands with the On Guard sanitizing mist, for sure. Sure. Hands. Hands. Rub them together. And your money. <laughs> you ready to go pick up the coals? Yeah. You can have a sleep if you want. Yeah. You want to have a sleep? Yeah. Okay. I love you. Yeah. That's my kids. <laughs> Look at these ones. So we just arrived to pick up our Coles order, so we would do that and take it home. This little guy needs a nap, and yeah, then we will do a Kmart haul and I'll tell you what I got. Okay, that is all done. My boot's looking pretty full, as you can see, <laughs> so we'll head home. A purple sunset just to taste of the weather The air is dense as my back sticks to the leather Pull up and stall, I keep my beer in the cellar The year was good and all and all I'm alright Forget it, it's not the way you mix up all of your letters It's not the page So I got all the shopping in just in time because I think it's just about to pee down with rain, but my little man's asleep in the car. Look at this. How can you wake that? Isaiah. My dog suffers insane anxiety. And when we are, like for me coming in from the car, to the house and she could see that we were home and she wasn't inside. She has destroyed my backyard. Look at this. First thing she did, she pulled my blanket from my bed that I washed off the line. She's dragged it around the pool, in the pool, and there's just water everywhere. So it's soaking, it needs another wash. And then, get this. Our bin. I can't believe it. In a space of a short two minutes. Yeah, what is that? Guilty. Hole in the back. Chewed the sides. Pulled everything off it. Totally destroyed it. Oh dear. Honestly. Mommy, look. Break the bin. Yay! Oh, hey Snoopy, you're not in trouble. Honestly, this dog actually drives me insane. <laughs> not you, my darling. And this one. 
always thinks he's in trouble when I tell the other one off. It's not you, mate. You're such a good boy. Mm. <laughs> you, mate. You. Yes, guilty face. But just in time, told you the rain was coming. So we got everyone in and the rain is here. Are you sorry? You don't look sorry. Bonk. 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 <laughs> Ready, big one? <laughs> you gonna get Nanny and Snoop? Boop. Get Nanny and Ah! Ah! <laughs> um. Oh, got Snoopy bum. <laughs> okay, so there's a lot going on in the background. We have washing hanging. We have a full counter of food that I just picked up. We have a Kmart table. So we're going to go through the Kmart stuff and I'm going to start to clear everything away, put the food away and start dinner before hubby gets home so what a day already it's been <laughs> okay so came up so it was meant to be like camper kind of orientated but obviously i bought what i saw because they haven't had stock for so many things for so long so if it's been on my wish list i kind of just grabbed it i, I texted my husband and i said look gonna do some damage today but <laughs> you know it's on my wish list anyway so um, because I got my new um, MacBook Pro I've been looking at covers and I wanted a new handbag anyway so I picked this up for $20 from Kmart and it is a handbag obviously it's a beautiful blush pink which is my favorite and inside it has a laptop case so laptop case for my MacBook and for my accessories and notebooks and whatever else I want to put in there. And it's also a blush pink. It's padded. What more do you want? So for 20 bucks, I thought that was a bit of a steal. So I got that. I'll link these all in the description as well. So if you want a blush pink handbag like me, you can get one. So there was that. Next thing, again, was not on a camper list. It was more for my YouTube and my Facebook. Um, when I do like my Facebook lives in my team groups and stuff like that. And um, when I'm educating people, I just look better through a ring light. So instead of spending however much you spend for a ring light, um, I bought this. So well, that was pretty cool. Um, can't even see it. So yeah, it is a studio selfie and it's got a stand. So it's on a tripod, it's got three different levels of lighting and it's USB powered, it rotates. So I'm looking forward to giving this a go. So yeah, again, I'll link that one, but this is pretty exciting. Okay, this one is for the camper. So this is a gray non-stick non-slip underlay so this is going to go in all of my cupboards just to stop like plates and toasters and everything moving around while we're traveling so and because it is a nice gray um it's going to fit the theme of the trailer so that one didn't break break the bank either <laughs> this one's obviously not camper related however we could pack it if we want but isaiah is has been using the potty successfully for so long now that I thought it was time to step up to the toilet. Now, I didn't want just any other toilet step, so I waited. <laughs> I waited until this was back in stock because you can take, you don't, sorry, you take this bit off and it wraps around the toilet and these become handles so it's a little hack that i was going to do but these have been out of stock for so long so i finally got one so now it's time to move up to the toilet now this one is 
trailer and house. I'll probably go back and get another one for the house, but this is for the trailer because our dogs do come camping with us. So I thought this is so freaking cute. <laughs> Wipe your paws. Look, it's for the doggies. Yeah. So wipe your paws. How cute is that? So this was only, I didn't even look at the price. I think it was $10. So yeah, I couldn't really go past that. That's super cute. I could even put it at the back door because um, obviously that's where the dogs go in and out. But I thought that was really sweet. So $10. It's been on my wish list for a little while too. Yeah. The next one was a foldable shelf. So if you have seen my cupboard, when I did my kitchen clean out and organize video, um, you would have seen that I was talking about these shelves. So these legs pop out when they're not stuck together. Pop out like that. You can see that. And yeah, I was going to use them for all of my plates and bowls and stuff like that. There was only one in stock, so I will have to look online, but it wasn't in the right area, so obviously someone had changed their mind and I'm forever grateful. Thank you. <laughs> so yeah, I got that one. We get oh yeah. So I got three of these magazine files. Now the reason being you're probably thinking, okay, random. This is for the camper. So I chose white because I'm going to be putting labels on this side. On here. But I have a little trick for this, but I'm not going to tell you why until we put it in the camper and I show you my little hack. So stay tuned and make sure you tune into any camper videos because this will be in there. So three of those. I got Isaiah some little shorties. They were super cute. So they were only $12. I also, I'm still breastfeeding. So I'm really, it's really hard to find a bra that keeps the boobs in. Breastfeeding mamas will know the problem. I'm wearing a sports bra from Kmart and it's the only one that I have and it's the only one that keeps the boobs in and send me up. <laughs> so I was gonna give this one a go. It was only $12. Um, they actually had my size because I'm D to double D. So that was really good. Usually there's only Bs and Cs on the rack and that just, I'm not even gonna look at them. So I liked how this had a bit of a belly band so it'll sit under here a little bit and doesn't dig in and stuff like that so I'm gonna give it a go it's wireless it is a little bit padded and a little bit of back support so yeah I'll give that a go I'm a bit of a sucker for pajama pants so I bought these pajama pants they look super duper cool they're like a um what's the word oh that's right the tag came off Waffle, that's the one. So they're like a waffle material. I don't know if you can see that. Waffle material. They were $15. Really cheap. And they're just slouchy and comfy. They are a bit see-through, so you have to remember to wear light undies when you're wearing them. But that's going to be my attire for pretty much every day. But yeah, it's a beautiful colour. So you can see it's like a lilac. So yeah, my favourite. And some more pants for Isaiah as well. So these are really cute. Ten bucks. Um, drawstring again. They got the little brown woven ends, which are cute. Um, and they're like a little pleated material. So I like that. Yeah, I'm talking in the camera. Yeah. Talking chair. I'm talking to the chair. It's on a chair. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Cutie. Okay, camper related again. So in my first camper video, um, the reveal video, I was talking about how little containers are gonna be key just to keep things in and keep them tidy and organized. Um, so I bought two of these little ones which were exactly the same as the one I showed in the van video. Um, yeah, so two of these. And then I did the same. I got two of the bigger ones as well. So these are going to be food boxes. So when we're packing um, to go away, I'm going to fill these with food, like snacks and all that kind of stuff that doesn't fit in the fridge. And that'll just be something that we can easily manoeuvre in and out of the van. We can put them in the annex or in the van. It doesn't really matter. Um, and it's still going to look pretty. So if it's cluttered in there, it doesn't matter. It's going to look aesthetically pleasing. <laughs> This one is for the camper. How freaking cute is that? 
<laughs> so I thought that would hang like near the door and we can hang all our keys and torches and stuff like that on there. I will get a few more little hooks um, that are similar so we can hang more stuff. But I thought that was so cute. So that was really cheap. It was like $4. So you could even paint it if you wanted to. But it's a real rustic looking wood. So I like that. Really cute. It's the little touches like that that are going to make this camper be amazing. A water bottle for our fridge. So we have installed a rainwater tank and these fit so nicely in the fridge. So I've got one in there already. So this will be a second one and we could probably even put a third in. I'll wait and see measurement wise. But these are like a dollar twenty-five. So yeah, and they're really easy. You can go out to the tank, fill them up and bring them in really easily. So. Yeah, that's a nice way to put them in the fridge. This is so cute. So I found this. It is a colouring in roll. Colouring in paper roll with a wooden stand. So you put that on the table or you can strap it to the side of the table because it's got little tabs. So on the side of the table or on the table and you just pull the roll out. They can colour on it. So you can see that's the pattern. And yeah. It's really cute, but that's such a clever idea. Six bucks. So good. <laughs> so you probably saw this in Kmart, in, in the footage when I was in Kmart, but how freaking cute. So that is a little silicon travel holder, travel bottle I should say, and it's a little koali bear. So I thought that would be good for Isaiah when we go camping put his soap in there and then he can squeeze it out and it's just fun. It's a bit of fun than a normal little boring one, so super cute. I got some of these because they're like $1.50 and they're your favourite toys, aren't they? Yeah. Yeah. Do you want to show them with what you're playing with right now? Yeah. Ready? Tongs. <laughs> Beautiful. So I bought some more because he stole some out of my drawer, obviously. And we need to send you to Tongs Anonymous, don't we? Yeah. Yeah, he is obsessed. Takes them everywhere. Look, he's already asking for them. Here you go. And the last item from Kmart is this little spiral album. So the reason I bought this is a really cute little cam camper hack that I got from one of the pages I'm on. Um, so it's like a memory book. So when you travel, you just keep it in the camper. You write, um, like a little travel log. So you write where you camped, um, all little memories that you want to remember. You can even put little photos in there or, you know, you can collect things. So it's like a little scrapbook for your travels. So I thought that was a cute idea. So I'm going to pimp this one out and make it cute for when we travel. And this one was a red dot purchase, so it is, you got two, he's still obsessing over his tongs. So this one was a red dot purchase, um, it is for, maybe it goes that way, probably that way, but it is for the camper and I'm going to use it to um, put my pots in there because pots and pans are so hard to organize in a camp trailer or even in your cupboard so you could even do the same thing in your pantry or wherever you keep your pots and pans so that was a really cheap little eight dollar purchase it's going to be handy i think and it's a nice gray so it's going to fit with the theme so win win and that is all of it okay guys so that's my little haul um, I can't wait to show you guys how we're putting it in the camper, but unfortunately I don't have everything that I wanted from Kmart just due to stock issues and stuff like that. So yeah, hopefully the camper video will be up soon. Make sure you like this video and make sure you subscribe to my channel so you can see the progress and yeah, keep up with me. So cool. Thanks for watching everyone and I will see you in the next video. Bye. Bye.
that just the taste of the weather 